What's up everyone, um, this is Pilot21 um, Today I'll be showing you how to get Microsoft Office 2003 for free um, As you can tell, um, my voice is kind of a bit different because I'm kind of a bit ill um, You might hear me like sneezing or something But um, I'll try my best to do this video yeah, So um, let's get started So first of all, what you have to do is go to uh, this video's description box um, I'll tell you the link to go to should be this one, a mega upload um, link and just refresh it and it should come up like this and you have to wait uh, 40 four seconds for it to uh, so you can download it or if you're a premium downloader then you press that but I'm not, I don't want to pay so um, I just use the regular one so you just wait for that um, so let's wait. Um, I know Microsoft two, Office 2003 is kind of a bit old, but that's the only prof version that I can get for you for free, because the other ones I can't really, well, um, do. Um, but anyway, Microsoft uh, Office 2003 is just as good as new ones as well. Anyway, so um, now you, you don't have to wait anymore. You can just press to download. So you press it, and it come up like that. Just close that. And this one should come up. This is a WinRAR file. So, um, if you haven't got WinRAR already, um, get WinRAR. I'll put the description on how to get that um, in the description box below. So, use WinRAR, save it, and press OK. Um, I'm not going to do that because I've already got it. But, uh, let me show you. Uh, it should be in my downloads file when you finish downloading it. It should take about 20 minutes, 30 minutes. How, that's how long it took me. Um, so that's what it's called, it's called Microsoft MS Office 213 Pro and so you click on that <coughs> excuse me and it's coming up like this and these are the two files you've got one saying MS Office 217 Pro and it's not actually 217, um, they just named it wrong but it's 213 um, and the second one is CD1 key text so just click on that and uh, I think you should just copy that just in case. It's the serial key for it. So you just copy that and go to this. Well, actually, no, you don't. Just extract that to. I'll just extract that to my desktop and just go do that. Um, if you don't want to waste time, then I think you should just skip this part. Now it's done because it just made that noise. So now we can close that and this. Just minimize that and go on this. And basically that's it. You just click on an application called Setup. So I'm just going to click on it. I'm not actually going to do this because I've already got this as I said before. But you click on Setup there and you just follow the instruction program thing that it says. So it says preparing to install. So we'll just wait for it. I'll show you the beginning part. But um, I'm, I'm still waiting for it, so you should skip this part if you don't want to wait that long. But um, yeah, here. It's trying to configure it. But I'm I'm gonna show you how, um when it opens it just looks like the normal version. Um, it's really good. I mean, basically you can use this for everything, anything. Um, it's got Word, uh, Excel, Outlook, PowerPoint, Publisher, all that. Um, it shouldn't come up like this, but um, because I've already got it, it'll show up like this. But um, if you haven't got it already, then you just follow the instructions on this um, setup guide. I'm sure, it's really easy. Um, yes. Um, 
I'm just going to open one of them. So as it, when it's finished, it should. So you just go on the start menu, or just you, you could just make it as a file on the desktop. But I didn't want to. So it should be a file called Microsoft Office. So you click that, and here's uh, just the normal ones: Access, Excel, InfoPath, Outlook, PowerPoint, Publisher, Word, and Tools. And um, it's 2003 version. As said already, I'm just going to open Word. And as you can see, this is just like the normal version. Um, so that's basically it, guys. Um, if you have any questions, um, feel free to um, comment below. And if you like my videos, please subscribe, rate, and comment. Um, thanks for watching, and see you next week.